Cringe pics when it hurts to look. Mom Spaghetti never forgetty. It's been nine years since Elon Musk had this photo permanently removed from the internet forever. Yeah, if you post it over here, that's pretty well cringe because it's not deleted from the internet forever if someone else has it. Found on Facebook. Don't even know where to... Why? You know what? You know what? It, it, it looks funny, but, you know, because of the spelling right there. Oh, please tell me someone in the comments said something about it, too. Nobody even paid attention to it! I, I've lost all humanity. You gots to be joking. Hi. What? Are you interested in hot VDIOP? VDIO calls. I got big eggplant if you want to see it. Bro, no one wants to see your eggplant. They could just go to the store if they want their own. Do you have cash app? No. How will you be paying? Pay? Yes. I don't think my landlord takes dick pics as a payment. Do you want me to ask? Ah, <laughs> uh, that's funny. Yeah. <laughs> Wish my landlord took dick pics as payment. Oh no, God! No, God, please, no! 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 A guy from my college submitted a private message as a status. I know we don't know each other much and it seems crazy, but I can't stop thinking about how good we would be together. I see you every day in the subway near college, although I know I don't know if you see me. Sticking out tongue face, and you're just beautiful. So if I could get your number, it would make my year, perhaps my life. If you have any dignity left, you should delete this. Oh, I think he meant to send this in a private message to someone. I'm dying. <laughs> Hey, hey, you know what? Dig maybe he won't have more dignity, but he is at least putting himself out there. Like, you gotta give him that. Fictosexuality is an umbrella term for anyone who experiences sexual attraction toward fictional characters, a general type of fictional character, or who's. So Jessica Rabbit? Only if you're into that kind of patty cake psycho stuff. That's a little too hardcore for me. Patty cake is forbidden in my religion. On a side note, just realizing now why I have an affinity for leggy red. What the f is this post? Wait, is this? It, that can't be real. Oh my god, it's real. You know, and I promise you, I like women, but I've never had some sort of attraction to Jessica Rabbit. For a cartoon, she is a very pretty woman for a cartoon. But all these guys who are always just like, oh my god, Jessica Rabbit, oh god, I wish I could f*** her. It's like, she's not even real. People are looking like her, but th th that's a cartoon, okay? Wait, what? Hello there, Editor Jacob here. This was a part in the video where I actually saw that someone decided to make an NFT on Technoblade's death. Um, I did report the person. If I happen to see any more things about Technoblade's death and people trying to promote NFTs or anything that they could try to get some clout from it, I will report them as well. That is sick and deplorable and disgusting. Do not ever f***ing do that shit again. Do you hear? You will get f***ing reported. Alright, bye. I hate this. Please clean up after your dog. Thank you. Dab. Okay, all right. At least that turned a lot better than the previous post. <laughs> clean up after your dog, bitch. <laughs> I love it. All right. Hell yeah. Can, can you dab? Okay. Check this out. You see what that dog is doing? Hey, 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 look. You see what that dog is doing? Okay. I want you to try and do that. I don't know if your arm can actually bend that way. That's why he's a cartoon. But clean up after you. No. Clean up after. You're not doing the dab right. I love you. Your phone is locked because of violation of the American government. Your heinous crimes will be met with serious fury and punishment for the crimes of communication with enemy state like North Korea, Syria, Iraq, Iran. For punishment, 10 year forced labor, 25 year prison. If you want to avoid these undesires, you must. Wait, undesire. You must pay 500 USA currency in Bitcoin, and we say nothing. We are police, we can do serious things. <laughs> that is beautiful. Oh my god. I want to get that message. My friend was sent this after not speaking to this guy for two years. They never even met each other. Miss Kentucky. There once was a girl I knew in a land too far for my eyes to view. She took care of horses far and wide all across the countryside. How she found me I do not recall, but oh how soon my heart did fall. 
We talked for weeks on end, and my feelings I could not no longer defend. For that blonde-haired girl had stolen my heart, but soon it would all fall apart. Aubrey was that beautiful girl's name, but she proved to be too wild to tame. Did two! Two! Today she may have forgotten me, but my love will always be with Miss Kentucky and that old memory. All I got to say, take care of yourself, okay? Oh my god. Oh, and someone responded two long years, his heart a flutter. John's love's name, he dare not mutter, but he summoned the courage, and just like that, his hot dog fingers open Facebook chat. Words spill out like milk and honey. Ones that horse girl would sure find funny, a misguided attempt at conversation only served to convey his desperation. John's love for her so plain to see he'll never forget Miss Kentucky. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I heard that as a Bo Burnham style rap. Damn it! Now you're gonna put Bo Burnham in my fucking head. No. A local rapper. When you realize that one girl you love, you once loved so much, no longer loves herself, and people suck. What? Being hassled for having a different point of view isn't cool. Being censored isn't either. Censorship is—it's not the vibe. Parlor.com. Isn't that where Trump went after he got kicked off Twitter? Hey, it's Nathan. Nathan, haha. <laughs> My phone was set to another language. How are you? How do you automatically forget to unset a language from your phone? Hey, doing some work. What's going on? I'm just catching up on some Game of Thrones. Okay, so I've been told I have this talent, but I've never tried it on someone I haven't met in person. Try me. Ha, ah, it's guessing a girl's bra size. Oh, okay, should I go for it? If you want, 34D. Yes, you are actually correct, that's weird. Haha, ah, or maybe I'm smart, I don't know. Or every girl says they are a 34D, so that was a safe guess. What is going on? Really? I didn't know that. My past three lovers have all had the same bra size, though, 32C. I'm pretty sure they weren't lying. So I don't know about your same bra size theory. Do you like yoga? No. Did I blow it? Yes. Bro. You don't compare t sizes with the woman. I want to press a button that makes sure all the people who say sex isn't important never have sex again. Why? I think it'd be funny. I don't want to hear a peep from them either. I want to see them live up to their word. Why are you making this into a thread? Who cares? Sex isn't important. It's caring about the person that you are having the sex with and, you know, being together. It, I don't really know how else to word this, but either way, it's not important. If you want to have kids or if you want to have some fun every now and again, whatever. But my God, it's not like you have to do it three, four, five, six, seven times a day. It, it's fine to, you know, be a normal person, not came across this in the wild today. Welcome to help. But, oh my God. All right, I'm, I'm done. I'm, I'm done.